I said to myself, after long, he's, he's been gone, what, 20 years or so. What would it have been like, and everybody knows it's a wonderful life. Yes. Yeah. It's the greatest comedy. We urge everyone to watch it. I thought, what would it be like if George Bailey, Jimmy Stewart, went back to Bedford Falls? Now. Now. Okay. Oh. It might go something like this. Uh, there, there's Jimmy Stewart, and, and this is the story of It Was a Wonderful Life. <laughs> I, I went down the block to the five and dime store, I, I, and a guy out in front said they don't exist and eat more. I, I walked a bit further to buy something at Sears, and they said there wasn't one there for going on years. Uh, I, I decided maybe I'd go buy a book, but when I asked where's the shop, you know, they gave me a strange look. <laughs> there were no yellow pages, nor Encyclopedia Britannica, nor wristwatch repair, nor Aww. film for my camera. <laughs> no, 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 no pay phones to call. No, no handwritten letter. Some kid on the street said something called an email was better. <laughs> there, there were no movie shows to go to. Just something called Cineplex. And no romantic love stories, just things about sex. I, I looked for, for a Howard Johnson's to get an ice cream, and there weren't any. I mean, it's like a bad dream. Where there once were folks on the street, nice to meet, you, you, you don't see them as much. I, I mean, they, they become obsolete. I done newspapers, radio, even a record store. They just went away. They're done. Never more. Now I wonder just what became of my past. I mean, what's left that really does last? So I called my old sweetheart, oh. Mary, on a thing called iPhone, and I saw a picture of her on the time at her home, and I got the weather report and all the ball scores, and a woman named Siri did all of my chores. You know, it's a good thing I lived in a time when I did, when it was great to be a grown-up, oh. or, or even a kid. So I'll sign off now as Jimmy Stewart, you see. And there's a good, real good chance you may not have even heard of me. <laughs> but I won't complain now. I, I, I won't shed a tear. Because it's your life now. So, uh, Happy New Year. <laughs>